Now at 5.30, decision day for South Florida pastor guilty of not practicing what he preaches. Good evening again, everybody. The Reverend learning the price that he will pay for taking thousands of dollars meant for a South Florida city. Seven's Vanessa Ruiz live at the Metro Justice Building in Miami where the judge just made her decision. Vanessa? That's right, Lynn. Inside a packed courtroom, popular but embattled Reverend Gaston Smith finally learned today what his fate will be after he was convicted back in December of stealing thousands of dollars in county grant money. Like to say it all before you go in? It's anything, in God's hands. Anything else you could say? There's in God's hands. Decision day finally arriving for Reverend Gaston Smith on Friday. So I am adjudicating you guilty. I'm sentencing you to five years of probation. You have to pay back the restitution, and I need the state to give the accurate um, total. Well, $9,999. I, I am guilty for using bad judgment. I am guilty for the mistakes that I've made in administration. The popular Liberty City pastor speaking to the court after several hours of testimonials from both his family and supporters on his behalf. And I know that he's a loving man, he's generous. You've heard that time and time again. I don't have to repeat myself how he's given to people. And I just beg you, Your Honor, that I must have like pastor that he should be going to, he should be going to prison, Your Honor. He's a kind person. He has helped so many people. He has touched so many people's lives. Smith was convicted back in December of third-degree grand theft for stealing thousands of dollars from a government grant intended to help revitalize Liberty City. Instead, prosecutors said he used those funds for trips to places like Orlando and Las Vegas. Still, on Friday, Smith maintained his innocence, acknowledging, though, that he has made some mistakes along the way. There were things that fell through the cracks. I was trying to be everything to everybody. I made mistakes with this grant. It was the first grant I've ever received in my life. So there you have it again, Reverend Gaston Smith sentenced to five years of probation. Also, restitution of almost $10,000. Also, 40 hours of community service each month during those five years of probation. But again, he was facing a maximum sentence of five years in prison. Reporting live this afternoon outside of the Metro Justice Building in Miami, I'm Vanessa Ruiz.